Welcome to Navatar, a fleet management solution to optimize you and your rental company's functionality and business. When introduced to Navatar, your company and employees will be given a username and password to log in on the Navatar.com website. Simply type in those details here under username and password and simply click sign in. After clicking sign in, you'll be greeted by what we call the dashboard. What the dashboard is, is it gives you an overall summary of your business's functionality and current performance. For instance, in the top left here, we have rental management summary. What the rental management summary was, is it gives you six key details about your rental management. For instance, we have today's reservations, which are the number of customers that are looking to pick up their cars today. Then we have today's arrivals, which are the number of customers that are going to be checking in their cars today. Then we have overdues. Overdues are the number of people that have not returned their cars by their return dates. Then we have opened agreements, which are how many total agreements there are that have not been closed. Pending payment, which are those that haven't paid yet. And finally, service alerts, which Navatar will automatically update you for each car. So for things such as oil changes and checkups. For instance, if we were to click today's reservations, we will be given a quick summary of the reservations that are coming today by customer name, type of vehicle, checkout date, and all these other details. Next, we have the quick lookup section. What the quick lookup section allows you to do is search for customers, agreements, reservations, or licenses with just a simple number. For instance, under phone number, if you simply type a customer's phone number, it will pull up their profile or allow you to make a new customer if they're not currently existent. You can also type in the agreement numbers, reservation numbers, and license numbers to do similar tasks. Then we have to-do summary, which shows you a list of things that your company needs to do for today, such as pickups, arrivals, and services. It acts as a checklist for the company. Then we have sales status. What sales status shows you is the overall performance of your company in the past couple of months. You can even separate this by location, as shown here. Next, we have vehicle status. Vehicle status shows your current fleet status, such as which vehicles are on rent, which vehicles are available, which vehicles are in service, and which have occurred in accidents. This can also be separated by location. Finally, we have your rate summary. With Navatar, you can configure different rates for different locations, as you can see here. Furthermore, you can configure a different number of rates as well for each location, such as daily rates, weekly rates, monthly rates, and hourly rates. Next, another feature of our dashboard is what we have what is called the daily planner. What the daily planner does is gives you a list of all your vehicles and what your plan is for them today. For instance, whether they're on agreement, they're on for reservation, they're an overdue agreement, or they're an online reservation. And this allows you to streamline your business processes in this manner. Furthermore, you can also easily add customers and make agreements from the dashboard. Now we will be going into more detailed observations about the different pages available in Avatar.